Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clay and in today's video we're going to be checking out the Veil 46 and Modern Warfare 2. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and also hit that like button. Today's like goal is going to be 15 likes. So if you guys could do that for me, I'd really appreciate it. Let's jump straight into the attachments. Over on the stock, I'm going to be using the Demo RXT stock. It adds crouch movement speed, sprint speed, and aim down sight speed. The cons are recoil control. Over on the tuning, I'm going to be taking away a negative 3.35 ounces to the weight to add aim down sight speed and negative 2.09 inches to the length to add aim walking speed. Over on the rear grip, I'm going to be using the Schlager Soldier Grip. It adds sprint to fire speed and aim down sight speed. The cons are recoil control. With the tuning, I'm taking away a negative 8.8 ounces to the weight to add aim down sight speed and negative 0.41 inches to the length, uh, width to add sprint to fire speed. Over on the underbarrel, I'm going to be using the Commando Foregrip to add aiming idle stability and recoil stabilization. The cons are aim down sight speed. With the tuning, I'm going to be taking away negative 0.65 ounces to the weight to add aim down sight speed and negative 0.36 inches to the length to add aim walking speed. Over on the barrel, we're going to be using the Schlager RVB barrel. It adds bullet velocity, damage range, recoil control, and hip fire accuracy. The cons are aim down sight speed, movement speed, and hip recoil control. With the tuning, I'm going to be adding 0.40 pounds to the weight to add aim, uh, recoil steadiness and negative 0.27 inches to the length to add aim down sight speed. And last but not least, over on the laser, I'm going to be using the VLK LZR 7 milliwatt to add aim down sight speed aiming stability and sprint to fire speed. The cons are laser visible in ADS. There is no tuning with that. Overall, this is a very, very good class setup for this gun. It is probably my best one yet. If you guys end up trying this class setup out and you like it, please let me know down in the comments. Or if you have a better class setup for me to use, please let me know what that is down in the comments. I have a crazy gameplay for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like button and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, we're going to be checking out the Vel 46, otherwise known as the MP7. I think my team is about to start talking. What is my... All right. <clears throat> Buddy just wanted to lay down. My game. I think I need to turn this down. I don't know why my PC is just trash with this this game. Let's see. I know this map a lot because I play a lot of CDO mush, but. This gun just does not seem like it right now. I remember it used to be so good in MW3. I don't even care if I die. I need, um, munitions box. Oh my. Let me know if y'all want these class setups. Jeez. Where? No teammate. Freaking squirrels. Oh, 
Alright, what am I doing? I didn't even know I had that. I just looked over. Didn't mean to pop the UAV in this, whatever. We're gonna run up here. Right, good job, teammate. I'm dead. We need to go ahead and rotate to this hard point. We need to start rotating more. I didn't mean to do that. I'm dead. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and go behind them. This gun is really good. I like this little red dot. Yeah, I need to be real careful. There's the nuke right there. Let's go. This gun is actually 
frying right now. I have 61 kills. I'm going to try to get more. <clears throat> Where? I thought that was a teammate. In the world, what's he doing? Put the moves on him, he didn't even know where to go. I think they're spawning in the back over there. What? I'm actually surprised they haven't backed out. Ninety kills. Hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. GG's.